Hey guys, it's me Derek. Welcome back to the channel and today I have another awesome unboxing. Now, earlier this week we unboxed the Xbox Series X and I'll go ahead and give you my little review for it. It's fast, powerful, and awesome. It basically just fixes everything that was wrong with the Xbox One and the One S and collates it into a brand new, more powerful, sexy package. Now it still looks like a refrigerator and that's okay. But I really love it. I've been playing with the Quick Resume, uh, testing all the backward compatible games. I wish there were some more games that was uh, out for launch, but that's okay. Uh, that will come later. As of right now, they're impossible to get. So I figured, you know, I've had a pre-order for a while. So I did that unboxing. But today, today, I have something a little bit awesome-er. Well, I don't know if it's cooler or not. Verdict's still out on that. I haven't played one. Uh, so this will be my first time seeing the system up close. I I wasn't a fan of the design whenever it first got um, shown off. I wasn't a fan of the design. The design. If I can get it open. And I just rip the whole box. Rip the whole box in half. Wow, well, that's okay. I'm not keeping the box. I know some people like to keep the boxes, but I myself don't want to do that. Is there a box within a box within a box? There is. Why is there so many boxes? Okay, that's why. Uh, let's go ahead and get the first thing out of the way. All right, so you get this box just like the Xbox had. Comes with your cord. Got your instruction booklet. What else we got? So sorry, HDMI cable. And this must be the stand. We'll find out here in a second. If I can get it open. I'm terrible at unboxings. Oh why? Yeah, so that's the uh, stand it comes with. Now the edition I got was the all digital edition because I only buy digital games unless it's on the Switch. Uh, the, the, if it's on the Switch, I usually buy a physical copy. I can't wait to hold this thing though. Oh wow. Oh wow. That feels super premium. Okay, that's that's sexy. That is nice. It's got a uh, little texture for the grips. It's like a little bit of a, a matte finish on the uh, triggers. Man, this is nice. There it is, all lit up. Man, that's nice. I think I like this more than I like the uh, Series X controller, which the Series X controller is basically the same as the Xbox One controller. There's not really much of a difference. Man, this thing is huge. Let's see if we can get it open without dropping it. That's going to be the hard part. Oh man, this thing is massive. Just look, look at that thing. And this is the old digital edition. I can't imagine what the uh, disc version's like. Oh man. Okay, it looks really nice up close. So, <laughs> there's the back of it. It's got your HDMI, power inputs. That is sexy. That is nice. It's it's a whole lot nicer in person than it is uh, through the ads and stuff. Looks like it's got USB-C and USB on the actual front of it. It's got a uh, physical power button, which is nice. Oh, Jesus, this is sweet, man. 
Let's get one more good look at it. Yeah, I'm sorry, this unboxing is terrible. All right. So, that's the PlayStation 5 All Digital Edition. Uh, if you are looking for one, good luck. I hope you find one. If you find a new Xbox, I will talk about the how everything works later on. Um, I don't have any big games for it yet. None of the next gen games. I'm hoping to get Demon Souls, a digital copy of Demon Souls, and a digital copy of Miles Morales, um, hopefully soon. And I'll kind of talk about that as well. But other than that, guys, thank you so much, and I'll talk to you soon.